Hey there, chat. How you doing? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Ruin. I run the place. Did you miss me? Welcome back to Omori. We're here in Otherworld, and uh, <laughs> we're running around a little bit. Uh, we've got to get a couple things done. We're doing our second playthrough, for those of you who don't know. And so if you haven't seen a first playthrough, get out. Because we're going to be talking about it. Um... We gotta go and do Space Boyfriend stuff. Uh, we picked up that quest to go talk, to go find that little bunny duck. Um, and by the way, if you're wondering what I mean by bunny duck, it's because this rascal right here is, uh, is based on a silhouette. Um, and people are supposed to wonder if that's a bunny facing to the left or a duck facing to the right. The stars are sure pretty, huh? That's why his name is Ducky Jr., even though he's a bunny. And that's also why uh, the parents never reference the species. They'll say, oh, it looks like uh, me. Back on my planet, you can hardly see any stars. When I grow up, I want to be a space captain. Then I'll be able to have that, this view all the time. But you can see it looks like a duck looking up at the sky. Oh, shoot. How long have I been here? Mom and Dad are pe probably super worried about me. I better head home quick. Okay. Let's fight this. Mm -hmm. Attack, attack, skill, uh, annoy. And let's see. Actually. Oh, I don't have mock on. I don't have mock on. Let's run, actually. Let's get mock on. <clears throat> Because, man, Mach is good. Mach is so good. Mach is so good. Uh, bread Slice is not super useful right now. We're not going to worry about it. Uh, but, uh, you know what, you know what, you know what, you know what? Bread Slice is better than Stab. Or, not Stab. Uh, it's better than Observe. We never use Observe. Alright. Oh, good. You're already angry. There we go. Ha 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 ha. There goes your attack. Oh, and Omori's not gotten leveled up enough, though, for it, for him to, uh, for him to do 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 do. Ooh, Omori's not been leveled up enough for him to get. Okay, to, I'm trying to think of the word juice. There we go. <laughs> Omori's not been leveled enough enough for him to get juice on uh, on heroes uh, on heroes follow ups. There we go. Look at that. Look at that experience we got. During the, the hike just now, I noticed a face indented in the cliff. Uh, pooped after that rigorous hike. Attack. Uh, er. Ooh, it costs 20 juice, and I've used up enough already. Uh, let's see. Plum juice. Venus flytrap feels angry. Look at Omori. Omori didn't notice Aubrey, so Aubrey attacks again. That was not a great, uh, not a great attack there. All right, let's end this. Woo, that's a good attack. Man, I love Mox so much. It's so good. Ow. <laughs> Could you not? Yeah. 135 experience. I love that experience. Oh. 18 experience. Boy, that's nothing. That is nothing. Okay. Uh, I think I need to go back to Mari again real quick. Mm. Although... I, I don't have to, I guess. Oh well. 
Lovely food. Amma nama nama. Do 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 do. Uh, not here. The only other place that we haven't really gone is down here. We can't go across that water yet. We can bust that uh, mimic to get that watermelon. Uh-huh. Like a big pizza pie. I do love that Somori. That's so funny. But let's try somebody different. So let's say that's Hero. You completed the message and threw the bottle back in the lake. Loamy loam, loamy loam. Loam is loamy. Loam is a type of earth, if you're wondering. Right in the heart. Man, that's good. Good damage. And uh, yeah, the moving attack. That was definitely going to be huge. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Life jam. It really works. Now, I'd like to see what is the difference money-wise for... Oh, uh, good. I was going to say, for killing a happy foe. There we go. Okay. So, I can get sad from Kel's ball hitting me in the head. 23 clams. That's not a great money increase, but it's uh, a thing. Um. Pocket. Snacks. What have I got? 100 juice, 35% of juice, 25% of juice, 25 juice, 35, heart to all friends. Here we go. Oh, sad. All right. Mm -hmm. Let's do a sad poem on me. Attack. Attack. And attack. Pass to Omori, get me sad so I'll become depressed. There we go. Whew. Still does a lot of damage. Just hit me with one more sad poem. And then... Let's pep talk this Venus flytrap. There we go. <laughs> Man, that Momori missable sprite is pretty great. Uh huh. Let's counter. And let's attack and attack. Aubrey readies her bat. Hmm, 94 damage is not that impressive, actually. Got it. Okay. And learn charm. I'll take it. Uh, skills. Hito. Hmm, okay. Kel, you do not have anything new. And you have nothing to replace either. So only Omori has empty skill slots. And he's got guard and observe. So we have no reason not- no reason to do those for right now. Do do do. I was just wrong. I thought that this place was going bad. But indeed it was not. Ooh! Octopus! You hooked an octopus, and then threw it back in the lake. I wonder if it's possible to get something new. Just waiting for a big catch. Yeah, what's the deal with the ghost? I don't understand that. Life jam. It really works. Mm. 
Yeah, get ourselves restored. Uh, we have an event here. I wonder if it's different since we found this place before we fought Space Boyfriend. Really, Mari? Shaved ice in this weather? Uh, what's wrong with that, Hero? It's so convenient. Shaved ice is way easier to come by than snow cones. What's the difference between shaved ice and snow cones, anyway? Well, realistically, there's not much of a difference. Snow cones just have larger pieces of ice than shaved ice. <clears throat> larger pieces of ice, huh? Is that why snow cones are so much more expensive? I... don't know, Cal. I can't really answer that one. Okay, yeah, that was the same. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't think we have any snow cone tickets at the time. No, we do not. So, let's fight the snow bunny. Mm -hmm. Pass the hero. We'll damage both of these snow bunnies. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Whoa, those snow bunnies have a lot of uh, health, apparently. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Let's get some bread from this bunny. Give me your bread. Whoo! Hitting like a truck. Let's go for it. Yeah, yeah, that worked out perfectly. Okay. Oh, let's go restore ourselves. You and your friends feel like new? Let me look at the faux facts real quick. Ah, uh, faux facts, faux facts. Here we go. Forest bunny, forest bunny. Sprout mole, big strong tree. Dust bunny, space bunny. UFO, Venus flytrap, wormhole. Uh, shark plane. Snow bunny. Whoa, snow bunny is way down here. Okay. I wonder why Snow Bunny is so far down there. It's like Snow Bunny is designed to actually be from a different place, but it's definitely from Otherworld. Who knows? Maybe somebody will know and be able to explain that later. Uh huh, uh huh. Here's the jamming place. And I need to come back here later uh, with Hero to get in there. I don't really feel like jamming right now. Uh, telescope. Mm-hmm. Vending machine. Tasty soda. Sure. Oh, you demons. Alright, let's finish you guys off and go uh, talk to Captain Space Boy. Get his quest and we'll head through the junkyard. We'll fight the Earth and take that out as well. Because I want to fill the full facts journal this time around. And by the way, like we saw with the tree in the last episode, if there is a thing that you know of where you're like, hey, here's a hidden foe or something like that, please tell me. I would love to find it. So, like, if there's any hidden places in the junkyard or, or on Otherworld in general where you're like, hey, here's a hidden enemy that you need to find in order to finish the journal, let me know. Uh-huh, there's the panda. We already talked to the panda. I think we've recycled everything we can recycle. Yes, we did. Uh, Band of Space Pirates been camping out. All right, let's talk to this guy. Hello, children. It's Captain Space Boy, uh, uh, Space Boyfriend. Oh, really? This is so cool. It's a space pirate place. Uh, well, it would be cool, but it's not cool because uh, this is a Captain Space, uh, Space Boyfriend is uh, in bed a lot. You want to go check him out? Ah, sure. <laughs> A vanity. A boombox. There's no cassette inside. There he is. 
<laughs> hey, face boyfriend, wake up! Kel. What? Uh, oh, my precious sweetheart. You sound so sad. Where have you run off to? Poor Captain Space Boy is dying of a broken heart. He suffers and suffers in shame and silence. We could wake him up with this t cassette tape, but oh no, it's not here. Where is the cassette? Somebody must have cleaned it away. We're doomed. We're all doomed. This is the end of our hopes. Oh, I see. Space Boyfriend isn't sick. He's lovesick. Oh, man. Well, let's go. Where are you going? Uh, I don't remember. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's like, didn't you know? And he's like, don't you talk about Hector. And it's like, I'm not talking about Hector. Should we help him? Let's say no. Please, Amori, I think he really needs your help. If you weren't sick in bed, you'd want somebody to help you too, right? Yes, okay, so bust thou must. Got the junkyard key. Interesting that we get the junkyard key, even though there was no way to get to the junkyard anyway. Because, uh, Snaily's in the way. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, we're already full health and everything, so we should be all good. Although, pockets, snacks, tofu, candy, bread, chocolate, life jam, orange juice. Uh, we should be okay. And we're level 8. I think we're, we are beyond the levels that we were when we fought this guy last time. So let's go for it. Would you like to disturb the planet? Of course. We shall mock. And we shall... Uh, counter. And we shall annoy. And we shall... Uh... Eh, just attack. Aubrey, ready for bat. Angry Earth. We've annoyed the planet. Good. The Earth takes 45 damage. Ow. Yeah. Let's get some health back onto Aubrey. Good show. Hmm. Let's see. Let's do headbutt. And annoy Aubrey. And you're going to use a rubber band on the planet. Oh. Made, uh, made Aubrey sad. Dagnabbit. Uh, let's do a pep talk on Kel. And have Kel do an annoy on Aubrey. And have Hero use some of our jacks. That was bad! Uh... This is just guard. And... Uh, you're going to... Attack. And you are going to charm. I think that's the right choice. Yeah, I think she'll survive just fine now. Yep, with the mock and everything in place and our higher level, now the Earth's ultimate attack is just void. And uh, they're going to attack. Pass to Aubrey. Let's really bring this to an end. Goodbye, world. 900 experience, and this time everybody got it. So there was nobody who's going to be behind for a long, long time.
Hallelujah. Uh-oh. We've lost the planet. Uh, we've really done it now, dude. I hope the captain won't be too mad when we tell him his favorite planet is missing. You know how he gets when he gets angry. Buddy, you're not supposed to tell, call him captain anymore. You have to call him space boyfriend, remember? Oh yeah, that's right. Uh, uh, uh. You know, dude, sometimes I wonder if we're even space pirates anymore. Ever since the sweetheart came along, we haven't done anything cool. We should just quit and get real jobs. Don't talk like that, but don't talk nonsense, buddy. What if, uh, what is life for us if not the space pirate life? I'm sure the captain will come to his senses one day and we'll all fly again. We must have to believe him. Huh. <sighs> Thanks, dude. You're always there when I need you. Cha. Okay. We're in the junkyard. There's Tarash. Ah, uh, I have just wiped out a planet. And you would stand in my way, you dumb little worm. You insignificant wretch. Crawling on your belly. You are nothing. Return to the dust. You don't even give good experience. You got backpack. They're my good men of some fine art. Fear not, for I know I'll find it. Equip. Uh-huh. No, you keep the blanket. It's good. Ah, uh, that's not bad either. Huh. Hmm. Okay. What is Aubrey's defense? She's 11. Dagnabbit. Omori is 19 with that flashlight. Uh, you know what? Let's give him the seer goggles. And equip Aubrey with the flashlight. So that way she can have normal defense. His defense is 11 even with the blanket, but that also gives him 10 more heart. Uh, hmm. I, I wonder if those four defense would actually be better. I am not sure. I believe this will let us go back and forth now. Lovely weather, isn't it? Yeah, it's not doing the whole, oh, I'm in your way. Basically, once we get past uh, that back area, then Snaily will no longer bar us from getting in and out. Here we are in the new area. So the plan is for this episode, we're going to do a good bit of cutting, but we're going to get through the junkyard as quickly as possible, get through uh, Space Boyfriend, and then uh, I think either this time around or in the next episode, we'll have uh, we'll be back in the normal world again, and we're going to see our moment of truth if there's anything big or worthwhile from uh, Gold Watch equipped. Hold on. Oh, it's fake gold. Useless in battle. The only thing we can do is, uh, is, uh, sell it. But yeah, I see our moment of truth if going back to, uh, let Kel knock on the door again and actually not, uh, answering the door does anything big enough to be worthwhile. And there's Kel diving through the garbage, forgetting what he's looking for and grabbing a can. And this is the first of our three items, if I remember right. Yep, the thing above Ab. Okay, and now we finally learn about... Uh, the, yeah, the throw block in the way. We finally learn about... Uh, what is it called? Uh, tagging. Whack. Great. Can... Can you feel the love tonight? Dial up. Kel is digging through trash. He didn't find anything. 
We're gonna use our candy here because the candy is less effective than Hero's Heal. Uh, 50% of juice. Mm-hmm. Apple juice. Let's use that. Uh, 25 juice. I have 19 juice that I'm missing. Right now, that's not a good deal. Whoop! Dagnabbit! I stepped one piece too high. Comet hammer. So, whoop. I should go ahead and equip our first new weapon. Alright. Let's rush back through here. There's that junkyard key that I need. Doggone it. Didn't mean to step on this. Oh well. Alright, let's get it. Reverse. Run down here. There we go. Phew. There's nothing up here to get, I don't think. Okay. So we're all good. We need to reverse this. Mm hmm. No, oh, you could avoid meeting the life jam guy at all. You could actually avoid that fight. Interesting. Um, alright. Well, let's go meet the life jam guy and get our health restored. Oh, yeah! Hey, kids, I'm the life jam guy. I sell life jam. It really works. Would you like a free demo? Uh, no. Don't be ridiculous. Of course you do. <laughs> oh, I didn't realize there was a separate transition there as well. Uh, I wonder a couple things. Can... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, can you be... Uh, have your stuff changed? Because Amori's the only one that's going to survive this attack. Amori did not succumb. The Life Jam guy used Life Jam. It really works. You got Life Jam. You got Life Jam. You got Life Jam. Skill. Let's, uh... Snack, and let's use the life jam on a uh, hero. Okay, and the life jam guy is talking about the the wonderful benefits of life jam. I wonder, can we affect the life jam guy with that stuff? I just want to experiment around with him a little bit because I know he's not going to kill me. Oh, you can make him sad. But he doesn't change, uh, he doesn't change his expression any. Uh, let's see, then. Let's actually, sad, let's actually, let's stab. Because it, or no, I'm not, I'm not sad. Oh, you know what, let's stab. And then you're going to snack and life jam Kel. Interesting. I wonder how much health the Life Jam guy has. Looks like it might be infinite. I don't know, though. Uh, snack. Uh, to do to do to do Oh, you know something I'd like to try? I'd like to try coming back here after I get, uh... Well, I know how to figure this out. Skill. Sad poem on me. And you're gonna skill, or no, you're just going to attack. And you are going to skill, and you're going to cook. Pass to Omori. We'll bonk Omori in the head, make him sad. There we go. Use the life jam, it really works. Fight. We're going to skill. <laughs> We're going to sad poem ourselves one more time. And Kel is going to annoy the life jam guy. And 
we are going to snack and juice up our boy. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't change his expression at all, even if he uh, does have changes in a... Uh, even if he does have changes in emotions. So now let's try Super Stab without any defense and see how much you get hurt. Because Stab will ignore defense. I wish I had a way to make you happy, but the moment I wake up Aubrey, then uh, the fight's over. Oh, here we'll do skill. Actually, yeah, I don't have anything really. I could... Yeah, r lowering your defense is not super helpful, I guess. This attack. Because we do have a boss coming up later. The attack did nothing. Okay. That's it. So you get two... Uh, if, you, if you get a crit, you do two... And, uh, and his defense apparently is limitless because even for attacks that ignore defense, it doesn't do anything. Alright, she'll wake up and the battle will end. Enjoy your free samples. Goodbye now. Interesting. Interesting. I wonder if there's a way to defeat him, or but that's probably would be an oversight if you could. Because I don't think there's any way to hurt him at all. Very good, yes? Uh, yeah. Let's go ahead and buy. Got Life Jam. Life Jam, it really works. Okay, I think we've already got... Did we got? Yeah, we got it. Okay. Then let's ride this in here. So we can ride it back out. I hate, I hate, I hate that it's this long, long path. But we'll live with it. Got life jam. You have to be very careful to scrape the walls and look for those little glowing red things, because they're only in the junkyard that they are just stuff that glows red on the ground. But they are items, and they are useful. There she is. There's my girl, with her famous junkyard wall chicken. Can. Ugh, this place is so gross and stinky, my nose can't take it anymore. What's the rush, Aubrey? There's so much treasure around. I'm gonna swipe as many cans as I can find. And then afterwards, we should recycle them at the recycling machine. I'm sure we passed by one on the way to Captain Spa uh, uh, Space Boyfriend's place. Ugh, forget cans. We gotta find the mixtape. Hang in there, Aubrey, you'll get past this. If anything, just think about all the good recycling you'll do for the environment. Yeah, come on, Aubrey, do it for the environment. And we discussed this last time, but there's no way that Kel's doing this for the environment. He just, he, he likes digging through trash. Because he's a funny little boy. All right. Hi, a doom box. Dead batteries. I think this is the path forward. Doohickey. Yeah, it is. Donut. Okay. Star fruit soda. Okay. So let's actually go the other direction. Do 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 do. And there's a watermelon up there that I missed. Bonk our way out. Now this is also a clue on getting these keys, because you have to use Aubrey to bonk that thing. But, when you do that, then you see that you can't get the key, so it's a kind of a, a clue you in that these keys are going to be a little bit hidden, unless, ooh, 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 unless you have Omori in the lead of the party. Because only Omori can find the keys. Poor Aubrey. Like, after the junkyard, I think that her smash ability is almost useless. Because, uh, let's see, we go to the spider woods, and it's just a running gag that her smash is never useful. Um, because 
she can't smash through the spider pile. And, uh, she... What was the other thing? She can't smash through, uh... She couldn't smash through something else. And then she goes to smash the thing of, uh, of Sweetheart. She goes to smash the thing of Sweetheart. And she's all like, man, I'm gonna do it this time. I'm actually gonna break this. I promise this time I'm not gonna fail. And, uh... Okay, that was weird. And she goes to wind up to smash it, and it just collapses on its own before she can even hit it. And it's like, ah, you've just been baited. Here it is. We're gonna do this scene, guys, because I love it. Uh, how are we supposed to find anything in here? There's just no way to, just way too much junk. Wait, what are we looking for again? Or what were, were we looking for something? <laughs> oh! <laughs> At long last, I finally found it! After countless hours of digging and digging, this one of a kind, ultra exclusive special mixtape finally belongs to me! Rosa! The number one sweetheart fan in the world! With this one of a kind addition to my collection, I will finally surpass all those lame posers out there! Wait! Oh no! This special mixtape, it smells like doo-doo. Oh no, I smell like doo-doo. Hold on, did she say she found the special mixtape? That's what we've been looking for. Oh yeah, let's go get it. I can hear everyone, everything goes saying, you know. And just as I suspected, owning something so valuable is already getting me into trouble. Oh <laughs> What's the matter? Are you jealous? This special mixtape is mine! I'll never give it to you! No, no, not ever! Hey, we didn't come all this way out here for nothing. If you don't just give us the special mixtape, we'll have to take it by force. Eek! Such savage behavior! Violence never solved anything, you know! Hmph! I'm much too refined for this nonsense! Farewell, peons! And you'll see you never! Wait, come back here! Hurry, Omori. After her. We can't let her get away. Here we go. You'll never catch me, stick legs. You have no legs at all, Rosa. Don't talk. You got a can. Rain cloud. Oh, that's super useful. Uh, Because that's going to be good for... Uh, what's her head? Uh, uh, Dagnabbit. That's gonna be good for... Oh, you demon. I forgot that's what she did. It's gonna be good for Sweetheart. Because she is the ultimate happy. And here is Hero's weapon. Baking pan. And Hero learns snack time. Snack time, boys. Spatula, baking pan. Skills. Let's get rid of guard and replace it with snack time. Let's get rid of charm. No, let's get rid of massage. There's no need for that. And replace it with smile. We have no need for massage. If we're in a bad situation as far as uh, as far as elements go, we can just do the inverse element. TV remote. That's good for I think Omori. Uh, increased defense, increased heart. Actually, I think that'd be better for Kel. One more defense, five less heart. Yeah, the defense is better. In my opinion. I- oh! That scared me. By the way. Not this. Aubrey is a cutie, but... I think that these change as they get better, because uh, she looks so different there. Whatchamacallit, yeah! Got a computer part. We're gonna eat some roasted chicken. You and your friends feel like new. I see you're keeping yourselves busy. I hope you're having a fun adventure. Uh, there's always one prepared. Yep, let's save right before this battle. And, 
enter the TVs of 404. I didn't notice that before, but it's 404 like Arrow 404. What's with her? Hey, Rosa, can you hear us? Huh? I wonder why she isn't responding. Let's take a closer look. I think we can... Oh. <laughs> Attack dot Omo. Let's do it. Let's dance, Omo. Let's do a mock. And let's do a pep talk. Let's annoy. And let's charm. Come and get me. The window feels angry. We're immediately going to wreck all of its attack. Getting me all happy. And you're going to attack. Hmm, what should you do? I guess just running gun is fine. And attack. Omori slashes wildly. Ooh, good damage, good damage, good damage. Look at Hero. Let's get you happy. And... Beyond getting you happy, let us also raise your defense. So that this angry Omo can barely do anything. And then... Now that this angry Omo can barely do anything, now we're going to have you counter. Actually, let's do one thing. Let's have you pep talk Kel to raise his speed a little bit more. Kel will attack. And Hero will also attack. Good damage. Crashes and burns. Here he comes. Dell attacks. Uh, let's see. Attack. Skill. Uh... Let's counter. Skill. Run and gun. Actually, let's back this up. Snack. You should cook some fries for everyone. Where is it? Bread. Granola bar. Don't we have something for everybody? Oh, there it is. It's popcorn. Uh... Hopefully, this will do it. Hopefully, hopefully. Look at Omori and attack again. There we go. Got it. Whew. Whew. That was a little bit tougher than I had hoped. And it got 404 experience. Woot woot. Even though it, it was angry, it did not give us different experience because it really wanted the joke of 404. What just happened? Who cares? We got to get back the special mixtape. Snatch. Huh? What in the world? Hey, that's mine. Give it back. No way. It's finders keepers. We're putting this back in Space Boyfriend's boombox where it belongs. Hmm. Space Boyfriend, you say? <laughs> oh, you ignorant child. Haven't you heard the latest news? I have a very red beetle source who tells me that Space Boyfriend and Sweetheart have long since parted ways. Why do you think this special mixtape is in the junkyard in the first place? It's because Space Boyfriend threw it away himself. Space Boyfriend threw away the special mixtape himself? Uh-oh. That's not good. But if Space Boyfriend and Sweetheart aren't together anymore, how will we ever wake up Space Boyfriend now? The future of the once great coalition of space pirates is depending on us. Humph! That sounds like your problem, not mine. Wait, just a second. How do we know you're not lying about all this? You could just be trying to get the special mixtape back. 
Well, I never. I may be rude and pretentious, but I'm not a liar. Like we trust you. You're, we'll just keep this special mixtape and see for ourselves. Now scram, you ugly prank creature. Go bother someone else. Oh my. So rude. You will pay for this, stupid boy. Mark my words. I wonder if these TVs do anything. They do not appear to do anything. And we knock this down. Plop. Okay. I think we've gotten everything out of the junkyard. There we go. Hold it right there. We finally found you, Pluto. There's no escape. <laughs> Snaily's died again. Oh no. My gigantic, well-defined arms and legs are giving out. I can't let it end like this. I need to find a hiding place. Hey, you there. Huh, huh. Please, lend me your assistance. Huh? Oh, uh, well, er, uh, hurry. I don't have much time. You need a place to hide, huh? Ah, I got it. You can rest easy now. I got this under control. Okay, there, that should do it. Shoot, they're coming. Oh, quick, everyone, act natural. Huh, huh. Dang it, we lost him. Hey, you kids, we're looking for a high-profile and very expensive rogue planet named Pluto. He's a big, circular, grayish guy with huge, bulging muscles. Kind of... kind of hard to miss. Have you seen him? Uh... Um... No, can't say we have. Really? Well, that's life. Come on, dude. Let's keep searching. We'll find him eventually. Okay, sir. Coast is clear. <laughs> Such quick thinking. I'm impressed. You have my eternal gratitude. What are your names, if I may ask? I'm Hero, and these are my friends, Aubrey and Kel. Oh, fine, young people. My name is Pluto. I am a rogue planet. A vagabond, if you will. I do apologize for causing everyone so much trouble. But I feel that it is not my purpose to act as a mere yard decoration. I want the freedom to roam the skies I please, like the birds and the stars. If that makes me a rogue planet, then so be it. They can call me what they please, so long as I'm free to do as I please. My soul yearns for freedom. You understand, don't you, children? Whoa, Kel, are you crying? <laughs> Straw emotion, I'm touched. That was beautiful, Pluto. You said it, Kel. Wait, you too, Aubrey? Now, at long last, I'm finally free to follow my lifelong dream of running down my own transportation company. I'm going to call it Pluto Space Line. That's <laughs> more like... <laughs> this realization has reinvigorated me. And since you have helped me in such a selfless way, I must return the favor. Ahem, I am a Pluto of Pluto Space Line. Act as if you just see, uh, come up to the station. Hello, Pluto. Greetings from Pluto Space Line. Where would you like to go today, young travelers? Ah. Oh, well, is that too much? Hmm. I should try to tone it down. Let's try this again. No, it's it's okay. We just like to go back to the campsite, please. So you want to go to the Otherworld campsite? Ah, my first request. How exciting! Oh no, here it comes. <laughs> One ride to Otherworld Campsite coming right up. I won't let you down, young travelers. Leave the rest to me. Is everyone strapped in? Wait, hold on. I'm not ready yet.
Greetings and welcome to Pluto Space Line. Where will your journey take you today? So you want to go to other world? You've got it. Now just sit back, relax, and enjoy the ride. Ha ha ha! That was a smooth ride. It was five stars. Ha ha ha! You can't even say that. You didn't have to hang on for dear life. Ah uh -huh. Repeat after me. When I flex, I feel my best. Now you try. Now when I flex, I feel my uh, best. Whoa! That felt amazing. I'm pumped. Hmm. I could use a little work, but nevertheless, you've definitely got the power within you. The, take this lesson and use it well. Farewell, children. Until next time. Way. Can't learn flex. And we want to buy some rubber bands. I own three. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Let's do that. And look at this. Some random... Oh man, how random and uh, and unique that we got happy. Some happy toys. How random. Lol random. Okay. Let's save over this. And what else did I need to do? I think we can finish the ducky quest because it was here. Look at that, Ducky Quest is done. I'm sorry, Dad. Thank you, young travelers, for finding our child. Here's a present. Dandelion, how freaking useless. We got a straight up dandelion. They gave us a weed. I forgot that's what they gave us. I forgot. Let's go bonk someone real- Oh, let's do two things, actually. Let's go turn in... shoobity doo Let's go turn in that quest. Oh, man, I can't- I remember how stupid I felt when I found that. I was like, oh. Yeah, there's a path here. Just like I pride myself on being a Zelda boy. And, uh, couldn't believe I didn't see that obvious hole in the wall. Oh, sweet, you found everything on my list. Da 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 da. da. Coffee. Da 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 da. Do 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 do. Oh, this is a girl after my own heart. And voila! Ah, that hits the spot. My old coffee machine broke like forever ago, but I've been too busy to gather the parts to fix it. Here's a little something for helping me out. You got dynamite. It actually looks kind of dangerous. It does 150 damage, which our super right now does 250. So dynamite, this would be the best time to use dynamite. We should probably use it on Space Boyfriend just for the lols. Although we are probably leveled to the point right now that we could wreck Space Boyfriend's shop already. Let's fight this guy so we can get... We need one more gold to buy one more of those sparklers. Pass to Aubrey. <laughs> I forgot the wormhole calls those guys. They should kill him. And now just one attack will kill this UFO. There we go. All right, let's go buy one more sparkler. I should also double check with Mari to see if I do have any more quests around here right now. Cliff face as usual. Uh, let's see. Basil, Captain of the Space Pirates, Rabbit Killer, Hector. I'm so dumb. Guys, I'm so dumb. I got the ability to tag Hero, and I didn't use him to buy the stuff. I'm so dumb. Dag nabbit, guys. I deserve all the shame. Just shove me in a corner and call me shameful. 
That was just so stupid. I knew, I knew I should use Hero for those, and I still did not. Okay. There's more wanted signs. Uh, we could. What could we do right now? Yeah. I think we're ready for this fight. I can't think of anything else to do. All right, special mixtape. Here we go. I wish there was a skip scene ability, but it's okay. We can we can power through this. Although this is another one of my favorite scenes here. So I might go through it. I know, the special mixtape will wake you up. It's like, oh, nuts, let's not do this. I probably shouldn't do this scene because, boy, doing, doing Angry Space Boyfriend really ravages my voice. But he's so cool. <laughs> Kel, what are you doing? No! Wakey, wakey, space boyfriend! Uh-oh. I got a bad feeling about this. What is that infernal racket? <laughs> he runs away. Darn it, Kel, look what you did! <laughs> Fear me, for I have awakened. Hmm. Uh, one second. <laughs> so cool. <laughs> Much better. Now, where was I? Oh, yes. Foolish children. I must thank you for bringing me out of that pathetic state. I grew tired of lying in bed, pretending to be sick. Like I always say, feelings are for losers! That wench, sweetheart. She's going to pay for leaving me. I did everything for her. I gave everything to her. Everything, you hear me? That ungrateful little... Ugh. Ugh. Just forget it! Forget everything! I'm going to find Sweetheart, and I'm going to make her pay! Sorry, but we can't let you do that, Space Boyfriend. Or should I say... Space Ex-Boyfriend! Interesting. You want to challenge me? Do you even know who I am? I am Captain of the Space Pirates. I control all the planets in the solar system, and have the ability to fly through space at a will. The power of the entire universe is at my command. Blah, blah, blah. Talk all you want. We're not scared of you. If you plan on going around and causing trouble, you're going to have to get through us first. Hmm. So that's how it's going to be. If you still insist on stopping me, I'm afraid we'll just have to settle this the hard way. I'll take all of you on. Fight me, earthly scum! There we go. Mmm. Yeah, this is a good song. What do we want? Let's start right away with some jacks. And... Uh, let's, uh, give ourselves a pep talk to Omori. And let's... Do a regular old attack here. And you're going to bust out the rubber band to lower his defense. Pass to Omori or Aubrey or Hero. Omori uses Jax. All foes speed fell. Rubber band, his defense fell. Toy. Let's use another rubber band. Let's attack. 
Let's uh, hit with. Uh... Hmm. Let's hit with a sparkler on Hero to get his speed up. And. Uh, let's hit with another Jax. Mori uses rubber band. It's defense spell again. Kel uses sparkler. Hero feels happy. Ow! Hero uses Jax. Took 25 damage. All foe speed fell. Look at Hero. Don't let your guard down. So we get her defense up, and we'll get her that happy. Uh, let's see. Let's granola bar hero. And you're going to pep talk Cal. And you are going to run and gun this SpaceX boyfriend. And you are going to smile. Granola bar. Moy, he's not taking as much damage as I would hope. 17 damage. Fight. Mm, what do we want to do? Let's let's get us even more happy. And you're going to Oh wait, you know what you're going to do? You're going to run and gun now. And I guess Hero is just going to attack. Whoo, right in the heart. Perfect. And I believe that Omori is still wearing the glasses that make it so he doesn't miss. Sadly, we don't have the, uh... Uh, we don't have the super, uh... Dagnabbit, what was it? Uh, yeah, sadly we don't have the, the, uh, Lucky Slice. That's very good when we're happy. But it will be okay. This should get him to frustration. My rage cannot be contained. You cannot placate me. Space ex-boyfriend became angry. Space ex-boyfriend can no longer become happy or sad. There we go. And now we're going to start doing heavy damage because we're all happy. So let's... Nuts. Let's mock. This is actually the perfect time to do that. Uh, let's counter again. You are going to confetti. And you are going to snack. And hit us with a nice, good juice. Yeah, I guess a lemonade would be the right thing to use here. Because Omori is going to... <laughs> the nice thing is, is again, we've got those Sears glasses on. And so we're not going to miss. So that worked out perfectly. Gah! How are you still moving? I, I won't let you defeat me! SpaceX boyfriend became enraged. Hack away at this guy. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we can still do it. It costs five to counter. And then... Kel... Could go ahead and dynamite. And just knock this guy out of the water. Yeah, I wonder what would happen if an ecstatic Kel dynamited. But we're not going to do that. We're actually going to run and gun. And then, Hero is going to cook for Aubrey because we know she's going to get attacked. Whew! Good hits. The tricky thing is that Hero is actually so fast now that she he, uh, he healed her before she, uh... This is your last chance! Space ex-boyfriend became furious. The interesting thing is, is that, uh, 
with each of these, when they become, uh, when Omori reaches the ultimate level, he kind of looks like them. So when Omori is furious, you can only see one of his eyes. Oh, which is a lot like Space Boyfriend. Let me mock him again, just in case. And Aubrey will attack. And Kel will dynamite. And Hero will attack. Just in case... Can't go any lower. Okay, I was gonna say, just in case upgrading his level a couple of times actually did increase his attack. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. Barely any damage. That was his ultimate attack. Oh, I love, I love being able to use these emotions so well against these super bosses and just trivializing the combat. Ah, oh, it makes me so, it, it feels so good to take something that's supposed to be hard. We got the eye patch, we got 1500 experience, woohoo. But it feels so good to take something that should be hard and just manage to, to work the system as is intended to make it really easy. It just feels good. It's fun. Oh, what happened? Where am I? He just doesn't have his patch anymore, by the way. Oh, my chest. Oh, yeah, you you were gonna aggro there. Oh, man, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have been aggro. Sweetheart, she was the love of my life. That special mixtape is very precious to us, so thank you for returning it to me. Oh, you're all good. You get some rest. Nah. We don't need rest. Oh, we've lost Pluto. And we're really sorry. Heh <laughs> You'll notice that Earth is not in his backyard anymore. I see. It's okay, you two. I'm even sure Pluto gets tired of just spinning there. It's all right. Let's go have some snow cones. But, oh, that's wonderful. It may be true that laying in bed will not heal a broken heart. But perhaps hanging out with some friends might. I'm afraid I haven't seen your friend, though. Oh no! Oh, oh nuts! Uh, 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 please don't cry. Here, let me give you a nice thing. <laughs> oh no! Oh, 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 please don't cry! Uh, let me give you another nice thing. Here, you get a train pass. <laughs> oh, okay. You ready, Captain? You keep your hopes up, little lady. If it gets too hard to bear, try eating a snow cone. It might make things a little easier. I mustn't keep my crew waiting. Good luck with everything, and thanks again. There's the F key. I believe this is the third actual labeled key we can get, which means this is the first time we can actually interact with the hole. Underneath the wet pillow. Or the E key, sorry. Nine keys left. There's a hole here. Reach into the hole? Yes. You felt a cold breeze. By the way, what did What's Her Head give us? I thought that she gave us coffee, but I do not remember now. Airhorn, present dandelion, can. Did she give us something to wear instead? Oh well, I don't remember, but I'll look it up. <laughs> He's sleeping in the corner, missed out on his chance to go to the park. Captain Space Boy's back to normal. I gotta let Captain Pink Pinkbeard run know right away. Interesting. I don't think I talked to him after that last time. Ah, the view here is spectacular. All right. Hmm. -hmm. Do do. 
And now, since we need to go through this area on the one side, you'll find now that the guy who was... Whoop, Good hit. Good hit. Bring this to an end. You'll find that the guy who was here is now on this side. He won't let us go in this side. There's all these guys having their lovely time. Eating our shaved ice. Last time, we got those snow cones and never actually wound up using them. Snow cone machine disrupt dispense the snow cone. I want to know how to get more, unless I think the only other way, Jash and many talents, is buy is to spend 5,000 a cone to buy them. So you can get a few free ones and everything after that is spending 5,000 a cone to buy them. And so maybe... Maybe, maybe we'll buy them if we ever feel like we need to, but if this is anything like we've seen before, I don't see any... I don't see any kind of bosses that convince me that I would need to buy them. So unless there's a major change that's caused by uh, not answering the door, or something else that you guys can tell me about, then I don't see any reason to buy those. I forgot to put Flex on Kel, I'm so dumb. I should have put Flex on Kel. I want to see how strong he can be. Haven't seen Basil anywhere. Sad, sad. That bitter whale. Space tube food. Uh, can I go to Vast Forest? I want to try fighting this tree again and seeing if I can be even close to causing any damage. Uh, vast forest. You got it. Now let's just sit back and relax. I can also drop off the puzzle. And so help me, if she gives me a dandelion for that puzzle, I'm gonna be all sad. Here we go. A flower puzzle for me. Oh, thank you. Here's a flower puzzle. Aren't they pretty? Got a daisy. I wonder what it should get. Oh, that's right. The daisy makes you auto happy. Which means I probably should have come back here earlier. Uh, oh, yeah. We can also juice up Aubrey's uh, 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 juice here. Hey, Van. All right. Let's burn through this scene real quick. Get Aubrey's 50 juice. We'll try fighting that tree in case you can only fight the tree on the first day because I can't remember. I Well, no, what am I saying? I can't remember. I have no clue at all. I've never fought this tree in any other timeline. So we'll try and make sure and see if we can only fight the tree on the first day. Not you, sorry. You're right, you're right. Let's get through this scene here. Bunk. Ha! Ah! 50 juice. Okay, good. It's funny because Hero never gets this. Like, Aubrey gets the 50 juice boost, and Kel gets the 50 heart boost, but Hero never actually gets any kind of one time booster. And also, not only does she get increased 50 juice, but she also loses all of her juice because that's the whole deal, is that she's burned through all of her juice, she's exhausted, and then she pushes a little further and basically finds where her second wind is. Alright. Now, we are level 11. We're like double the level we were before. We have... We're going to Skills and Omori, and we're going to get rid of Hackaway because that's not useful. We're going to replace it with Stab. We're going to get ourselves ready to do super stabs. Uh, you don't have... Wait, yeah, you got that already. Let's see, do you have any super specials right now? Flex and curveball. 
Let's get rid of Flex. And you... can get rid of Guard. No, you can get rid of Pep Talk in exchange for Team Spirit. And... I guess you can get rid of Guard for Twirl. Eat all. Yeah, you don't really have anything. Alright, let's try fighting this tree. There you are. Ah, uh, sad poem to me. Let's see. That's Team Spirit with Kel. Let's flex. And let's attack. Aubrey feels happy. Still does nothing. Let's do another sad poem. Aubrey. Uh, no. Aubrey is going to Team Spirit again on Kel. And Kel is going to annoy Aubrey. Actually, that's in that's bad order, because Aubrey's gonna team spirit first. Kel is just going to run and gun, I guess. And here is going to attack. Kel's attack did nothing again. Woo! Not good. Okay. Sad poem myself one more time. And then you're going to. Headbutt, and you're going to annoy. You're going to attack. Wow. It did nothing. Stab. It's time. Uh, let's see. I guess. Keep headbutting. And you are going to flex. And then you are going to attack. Okay, feels his best. His hit rate rose. Bonk. Did nothing. Call Aubrey. So she can get some health back. Ooh. Okay. So the tree is fightable. The tree is not like Life Jam Guy. The tree is fightable. He's just really tough. Um. So I guess you're just going to. We have four of these. You're going to rubber band the tree over and over again. Oh, yeah, because rubber bands do a defined amount of damage. And I should have kept. Dag nabbit. Dag nabbit. I should have kept the, the dynamite because the dynamite also does a set amount of damage. Uh, so you're going to also rubber band the tree. And you're going to attack. Okay. So we could item this tree to death if we wanted to. Wow. Such a strong tree. Let's rubber band again. Let's do... Uh... Yeah, we got nothing but jacks and rubber bands. And you can snack. And you're going to give a tasty soda to... Oh, no, you're not. You're going to give... Apple juice to Omori. 25! Okay. Flex. Snack. Apple juice. Omori. 
Let's see if we can take out this tree. Yeah, this is doable. This is doable. We'll hit him with everything we can do. Actually, let's try headbutting. And you can go ahead and run and gun. And you can attack. Nope, did nothing. The only one that can hurt this tree is Omori. <laughs> and it's only because his stab ignores, uh, defense. Let's, uh, do this again. And annoy. See if that'll make a difference at all. Because it will help a lot if, uh... If we're able to get some kind of... Some kind of use. Still nothing! Dag nabbit! <laughs> Just beating our face on this tree. 69 damage. Ah, you go enjoy yourself, chat. Um... I guess just attack then instead. Poopadoopadoopadoopa. Hmm... I guess you just attack. And hero... Can just attack. Alright, nobody does anything except for Omori. <laughs> Just stabbing this tree with our knife over and over. Uh huh. Give him a little more damage. Wish we had kept the dynamite. Wish we had kept the dynamite, but I did not. It's my own foolishness, my own hubris. Uh, cherry soda. No, I, I think a tasty is the best choice here. Can we sparkle this tree? That'd be great. Big strong tree cannot get happier. Okay. Nothing I can do then. It's close. It's a close. And it won't attack us, so we can't get the super off on it. Or this would be a pretty much done fight already. Unless, of course, when it attacked us, it was just incredibly strong. Yep, this is the end. It should not survive this. Yeah! Aubrey's party was victorious. He gained 500 XP. Learned Lucky Slice. I wonder... If there's anything else in the faux facts now. Big strong tree. Wow, it's so big and strong. And that's it, apparently. Hmm. The fierce alter ego of Captain Space Boy, Captain of the Space Pirates. He comes out when Captain Space Boy is angry, commands the planets of the solar system. Interesting. Okay. So there was not really anything special. Now, what am I missing here? Yield Sprout. And there's two things before Pluto. Hmm. <laughs> no. Oh, oh, oh. I should actually go to the train station real quick. While I'm here. Now, I wonder if that, uh, tree is going to be like other enemies that will appear. 
again when I come back. Oh, the trains people are still here. But howdy do is gone. Who's this? What tomfoolery is this? I demand you let me see my family at once. Do I look like a tom to you? Screaming in my ear ain't gonna get make the train run any faster, lady. Uh-huh. There's these guys. I am dead sure not talking to the bee. You have to kill three more bunnies for your next prize. Go out and kill more bunnies. Okay. Nah. Because if I give you clams, I'm going to have to listen to your song, and I don't really feel like it right now. Ah, yeah, the tree is gone. Woo! Good damage. The other thing we can do before we return to the real world is we can go up the pinwheel and fight the kite kid. And we can get ourselves another uh, doodad. So let's restore some of our healing items. Eat all. It all da, 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 da. uh apple juice Let's get some jacks Okay Oh and we should water the plants All right, I will blink to the other side of this real quick because I know that watering the plants is kind of nothing. Okay. We are going to go ahead and save real quick. Choopity doo. Okay. We just saved uh, real quick after we watered those plants. Um, something that we're going to do is uh, I'm going to do a couple of things. Uh, during the interim here is I'm going to go and go through the junkyard and I'm going to uh, uh, Run away from fights over and over and over again until I can get enough uh, enough uh, cans and everything to finish off the quest for the for the recycle bin um, and then when we come back we'll, we'll, we'll get the the recycle bin quest finished up and we'll finish up any other quest that we have at the moment. I don't think there's really that many. I think I'll go to the pinwheel area and we'll fight the kite kid again because I feel pretty confident fighting the kite kid, yeah, even though we're at this early stage in the game because, again, we've really trivialized the combat system and it, it's just so good to be able to take bosses out early. So we'll come back, we'll finish up the, 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 dagnabbit, what is it called? We'll finish up the the recycling thing we'll fight the kite kid and then we will go into this barn uh, uh field area and we'll follow shadow basil and we'll wake up and then we'll have our split decision and that's where i'm going to break up uh uh into different save files just in case it really matters so that way i can have a save file of the path that we're already on because i want to go to the regular world and meet everyone and collect every flower that I can. Um, uh, uh, and I will want some help with that. It's like, where are people hiding so that I can help them so that I can get their flowers? Um, and then uh, I'll have a different save file in case that's like really, really wildly different so that I can just do two separate things. But all of that is going to come up next time around. For right now, we're going to have to go ahead and call it. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you had a lovely time. I hope that you are pumped and excited that we are now getting ready to branch off because a couple of you have told me over and over again, boy, it's going to be a real big difference if you if you uh, don't answer the door for Kel. Boy, it's going to be a big difference if you don't answer the door for Kel. And, uh, and so I, I really understand that it's supposed to be a really big difference. So, uh, so this time around... We will have one where we answer the door so I can get those flowers and one where we do not answer the door So whatever happens there will happen and uh, I hope you are excited. I hope you're excited cuz man <laughs> uh, I want to see the rest of what this game has to offer 
And uh, I don't want to put it to rest until I'm certain I've seen all the things. So, uh, so tell me your thoughts. Because it's going to be another weekend until I get back into this. And so, this is your, this is your chance. If there's anything I need to know now, let me know now. Now. It'll be next week when you see me again. So I do know that you're going to miss me. But try not to miss me too much, okay? Bye!